If your studio strobes don't have a built-in trigger, you'll need something along the lines of a pocket wizard or let's say a young Nuo to trigger these lights. And it's real simple. From here, what I'm gonna do is connect my sync cord here and plug it right into the back of the sync uh, port of the studio strobe. Now, what do I do with this? In the past, I have to admit, I got lazy a few times and would just put it on something like this or I would just wrap it around maybe a knuckle, like so. Now that's fine, but if you start to move your lights, that's gonna come crashing down. So a better alternative is simply taking it, wrapping it around, and securing it like so. Then from here, I could put the sync cord back in, and we're set. So now if I were to move the light up or down, or even move it from one location to another, I'm not worried about my trigger falling to the ground.